back to another Atomic Tuesday, and we got it's been, some stuff. It's been like about three weeks. This video is going to be on Hot Wheels and Matchbox. Yeah, it's been like three weeks since we did a video. We've been kind of busy, and we kind of changed the background here a little bit. We moved the t table somewhere else to give you guys a little bit different background. So, let's start out with this guy here. We got one of these crack ups. Yeah. I have to, yeah, there it goes. Focus it in this police car. And that's the crack side, and that's the together side. And that's a pretty nice, pretty decent shape. Metal base. So, with that one, got a second monster and charger. Oh, yeah, we did these already. Did you want the turntable anyhow, Tommy? Um, I don't know. Then we got this Camaro. And we got this one here, the Spider-Man. This series, this every time I go there, the 67 Chevy truck is not there. They've got like a whole, uh, one whole peg full of the circle trucker, tracker, one whole, one whole peg full of the charger. About three quarters of the sand blaster and about half a peg of the Camaros, but not one pickup truck. It's amazing how everyone just grabs, they grab all, every single Chevy truck and they leave everything else behind. I mean, I understand that maybe that's the popular one, but the greed is just incredible. It's just incredible, the greed out there. But we got the one Camaro, so I guess it's better than nothing. And then now we got this, this one here. Hunt. Yeah, it's a regular treasure hunt here. 41 willies. Yeah, I've heard a lot of people complaining about uh, one, they, like they're not happy. They're, they want to get out of collecting because it's no fun to have to buy online everything or buy from somebody. The enjoyment of this hobby is to go and find the stuff out there on the pegs. That's the enjoyment. When you can't do that anymore, it kind of you kind of lose interest. It's no longer fun anymore. You know, finding it's the fun part. Not not having to go buy it from somebody else because they take everything. There's no fun in that. Maybe that's why it's yeah. been a while. We've been busy. We've been real busy, so we haven't done a video in a long time. But it's kind of um, you know, it is what it is. Then we got this Jurassic World. Yeah, World these I found. Actually, I found these today. But, I, of course, you know, you don't find everything. And there, there was quite a bit of them there. But this was the only cheap Cherokee that was on the peg. Otherwise, I would have got a second one for Tommy. I couldn't get it's one. It's just like that other one, though. Is it the same truck? I think so. It's the exact same truck as the as the mainline one? Man, it won't focus in on it. I'm having a and hard time. There it goes. Jeep Gladiator. And I finally focused in on it. Yeah, then we got the Jeep Gladiator, but that was the only ones that I got. Uh, I didn't I didn't expect to find the Ford pickup or the Chevy pickup. I actually didn't, I was surprised to see any of these. So this is a new casting here, this, this Gladiator. Yeah. So they actually had two of them. I guess this isn't the popular one. But yeah, that's kind of cool. It's totally different than the other Jeep Gladiator that, that uh, Matchbox has, for sure. It's definitely a brand new casting. It's pretty cool. Alright. And then we got this uh, Matchbox. You know, we'll take this one out, because this, this card is all falling apart anyhow. We'll just rip it out of there anyhow. Yeah, this up. Uh, this up. these cars, they don't have... None of these Matchbox ones have... Uh, metal bases but they do have rubber tires on this premium set and yeah. it's got all those rubber bands on there you can get it all off of there oh, but the car is yeah the car is all detailed out though it should have yeah see it's got it does have all the the back detail and it's got the trim all the trim is detailed in the interior is detailed on it form of v8 and it does have rubber tires, but it's got a plastic base. And it's got some detail on the front. It's got the blacked out and the scoops. The bird on the front nose. So it's pretty cool. Definitely a pretty cool car. All right. Then we got some Suburbans. Yeah. In the Hot Wheels Racing Suburban Series. I have the 55... 
one. I think it's the only one I have, ain't it? And now here's the 40. Not sure. I think it's four trucks. Yeah, four of them. So I think I have off. I don't know. I think I'm missing one. Because this is the 40. I got the 55 and I have one more. Here's the 60. And here's the 60. So I am miss. Oh, uh, you know which one I'm missing? I'm missing the five. Actually, I have the five. I have the five, but I have it listed on eBay. So, actually, I do have the fourth truck, but I listed it on eBay instead. So, mm. so I have three out of the four. School bus. And the school bus series. I guess school bus, they have uh, four in the school bus series. So, let's see. I got the McDonald's one. I think I only got two of these. I don't... Yeah, I think so, because I have... I don't have any of these loose. No, no, there's none loose, right, Tommy? No. no. And then the 44. I have the 44 in the uh, the motorhome. I, I, so I guess there's four for the GMC motorhome. I have the 44 in the GMC motorhome one. So this one's the number one. The bus has one. rubber. Does the, the bus has rubber? Yeah. A lot of the Suburbans don't. The Suburbans got plastic wheels. Yeah, same with the AMC motorhome. The GMC Motorhome? Yeah. It's got plastic wheels, too. Wow, the bus says rubber. Wow, that's amazing. Oh, that's cool. 100% Hot Wheels. And we got, I, I got picked up a couple 100% Hot Wheel ones. Most of these that I picked up, I put them on, I put them on our, in our eBay store. But I kept this one, and then I had, I had another one, a different color. And so I, I didn't want, I was going to keep them both, but then I said, nah, I better just keep one. So I kept this one. The other one I just listed on eBay. So this one's the orange and white one. I think the other one I got was what, teal? Teal and white was the other one. Yeah. So I listed that one. And then this one is the Firebird. The white Firebird. I mean, the blue one. I have the white one, and now I have the blue one. I just, this one here, I just, I like this casting. I like this car itself a lot. So there's I had a, one. yeah, there's the white one. Yeah. But actually, that white one, I think that's from a two-pack. Yeah. It comes with the Camaro? No. The Challenger. The Challenger. Yeah. And I have those. I have the Challenger, that one, and then the Camaro and the Mustang are the other two, I think. Yeah. And then I got this, this guy here. These are Super Chromes. I actually had two of these, so I kept one, and then the other one I just listed. These have... Plastic wheels on these. These are plastic wheels on these. Yeah. So I had two of these drag buses, so I kept one, and the other one I listed. And this one's actually super chrome, but it's actually a gold. It's gold. It's not chrome. But it's a cool casting. I love that casting. And then the other one was the GMC Motorhome. I had two of these, too. So I kept one, and I listed one. And this one also has uh, plastic wheels. Feels like it might have a metal base on this GMC. Kind of looks like a metal base. Eh? I think this has a metal yeah. base on it. I think they all have metal bases. Do they? Yeah, yeah maybe they do. This series might. This is yeah. This series might have metal bases on them. Yeah. And then there's and then the one. final run. A couple of final runs. Yeah, I picked up a few final runs. I got like I don't know. I got a couple of these, so I kept one since I had like two or three of them. So we got this 55 Chevy. This is the 55 Chevy. The ugly 55 Chevy body. The first, actually the first Hot Wheels 55 Chevy casting. So we got that one. And then the yeah. Unimog. See, that one's got rubber wheels. The Unimog has plastic. Yeah. This one's got plastic wheels. All right. And then... And then this truck, the Ram truck. This this thing looks awesome. This looks really cool. I like the way they yeah. did this one. And this one, I think, has rubber wheels, too. Yeah, they go. Out, they went all out on that one. Yeah, this one, they went way off. You know what? Other one? No, that's California Customs. No, my fault. I was thinking of something else. Yeah, these are the early, the early final run vehicles. These, they did, they kind of went real all out on them. On, on these, then that, then this is 2001, I think. 
But then, like, by 2003, 2004, they were just regular, just mainline cars. They didn't have no fancy paint or anything on them. And then I also got the Porsche. This is a good one. This, this thing's kind of pricey. So I was glad to get one of these. This is an awesome one. Porsche 911. Alright. And then got another Serato. Another Suburban. Another Suburban. This one is Whips. Whips series. And this one has definitely has the rubber wheels on it. It's got the rear riders. This one's a really cool. And it's nice because it's just a solid color. No temple work on it. And I think they have a yeah, they have a screen on the back. You can see both sides of the truck. It's pretty cool. And then we found the boulevard. Yeah, yeah. I think I've did I get the whole set once? Yeah, I did. I got the whole set. I actually got the whole set of this. I couldn't believe I actually found the whole set. That is just usually usually it's pretty hard to find them. No second holding though. Uh no, I couldn't it was it was hard. They were hard to find. Yeah. So this car was this I think is the weakest one out of them is this Corvette because it almost looks just like the first version almost. Except it says Hot Wheels all over. It's crazy looking. I think the first one was better looking than this one. This one's a little weaker. Maybe the next version will be nicer. Who knows? It's hard to say. And then the Supra 2020 Supra is pretty cool. Now this is different than the mainline car, ain't it, Tommy? Uh, it's just a premium version of the mainline. Oh, isn't there another version of this car besides this yeah. one? Yeah. That's what I thought. I thought there was another version. So this one's red and white. Pretty cool. This one's new. Yeah. You know what? This car, this car, when I see this car, I think of Matchbox. Matchbox made one almost identical to this. I Pretty close to it. This is the Alfa Romeo. Now, Matchbox did this thing back in... Like the early 2000, like 01 or 2000. Maybe maybe even back in the 90s they might have made it. I can't remember. But I know this is a... And it, it's red and I think it has an 8 on it. It might even be the exact same tempo work as the Matchbox one. I'm not sure. I, mine's put away I, in a case. I haven't dug it out yet. Maybe I should do Alfa Romero's and I can dig it out and match it up with this car. To see if it's actually the same. Sure it looks like it. Sure looks like the Matchbox version. And our new casting. And our new casting. This 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 one's got a couple new castings in it. And this is the Holden. The Holden Mon Mon Monroe? 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 GTS. So that's a pretty cool car. See now Matchbox does make some holding castings, but they don't make a coupe, a two-door coupe. And those castings are mostly from like the 90s. So it's pretty cool to see Hot Wheels do a Holden. Need to, still need to find one. Now I found two Mercedes. I actually yeah. didn't realize that Tommy wanted the Holden. Otherwise I would have picked it up at the time. So I think they might have had a second Holden. I'm not 100% sure. But I, I knew he wanted the Mercedes for sure. So that's that's definitely a cool car. Drag bus. And I got a drag bus. And then all the these are that, all the ones after that are like racing. Alright. The drag bus is hard to come by one of these. This is kind of cool. It's orange and white. Kind of plain, which is nice to see them see it plain. And it actually has see and this one actually has real riders in the front. But it doesn't I think the back is just plastic wheels on this one. So these things are weird. Sometimes they have all rear riders on them. Sometimes they only have rear riders in the back, not in the front. Sometimes, like this one, has it in the front, but not the back. And then some don't even have rear riders on them at all. So these drag buses could be all different kind of ways. Yeah. So this is kind of cool. The it's only kind of metal and metal. The what? Yeah, they're all... Well, the only one that's not metal and metal that I know of is the uh, color, color changer. Thing. Dodge Dart. So I got a Motor City Muscle Dodge Dart. This is a cool one, too. And this, this has the rear riders on it. So it's pretty cool if, to get one of these, pick one of these up. Hard to find these older Hot Wheel 
racing series cars. They're not easy to come by. Snake. And then I got I also got a snake. This is Hall of Fame. Stuff. Hall of Fame. No, I didn't I didn't I only got the one. I didn't see the other one. Actually I picked this this up of on whatnot. I got this one on whatnot. You're coming off a two pack of snake and mongoose. Oh, another two pack? Yeah. But are they gonna be red and yellow? Yeah. Cause they come they come red and yellow, they come white and blue. And there's there's a couple different colors, variations I want. There's a black one too, yeah. And then I got another Hall of Famer. This one's Richard Petty. And this is the sixty sixty seven Plymouth, maybe? I think it's the 67. 67 plan. Does it say on there? Uh, do, 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 does it say? It doesn't even say. On the card. It doesn't even say what card, what card this one is. That's weird. Unless I'm missing it somewhere. I'm pretty sure it's a 67 point. That's what it looks like to me. So that's a cool one. And then the last uh, one. Is this two pack? Is this one here the 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 fair the Talladega and the Chevelle? You want to open that one? Cause let's, let's check those out. Yeah, that's those are really cool. Actually, I, did, I couldn't wait to find one in the store, so I had I bought it online, kind of cheated, cause I don't know if I'll ever find them in the stores. Wow, cause this is gonna probably go. Everyone's gonna scoop these up when they come out. So I just bought one. I didn't wait. So here's the Talladega. It's nice to see this car back in premium. 427. And an Eraso Deco too on top. Wow. So that one's pretty cool. And then this car is even more awesome to see. There's not a whole lot of these 67 or 66 Chevelles. So that's really cool to see this car back. Not a whole lot of Talladegas in premium. No, but that, but at least you can you can get them in the main line. This car, you is only premium, and there's not a whole lot of them out there. So I have let's see, I have this one, and I have one or two other ones. I think. Oh, you have a yellow one. Yeah, yellow blue and blue one. one. I think that's it. So I'm I, I know I'm missing the Boulevard one, which is yeah, white. There's the vintage racing one. Yeah, that's the black one. And then the convention. Gold. Oh yeah, so I only have two then. There's only that's the fifth one. Yeah, there's yeah, there's not a lot of this casting, there's so only it's really three cool. Talladega. This is the third Talladega in premium. Yeah, in premium, yeah. I mean, that's the two your... vintage racing ones. Yeah, I don't have the vintage racing ones. They're too expensive. They're more expensive than all the Chevelles. Yeah, they are. That's because they're I think they came out in that last um that last series and they were limited. They kinda cut that series short the last the yeah, last, the last uh set. the last set, yeah. They kind of cut it short from what I hear. So that's why they're they're more expensive than any, any of the other ones. Yeah. All right, well, yeah, the, it's been like three weeks, guys, so it's been a while. Yeah. Things have been built up a little. Hope you enjoyed the video. Comment down below. Subscribe. Hit the bell and like. And see you on the next video. All right, and we'll catch you guys later. Bye. Bye.